Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I woke up this morning and for some reason I'm just happy. I woke up feeling extra happy. So I decided to go ahead and make myself some fried dumplings because that's what I'm feeling for. So welcome to my channel. If you are new, welcome. If you have already subscribed, glad to have you. Right now I'm going to make some fried dumplings so let's jump into the video so first i'm going to start off with three cups of flour three cups of flour and to that, I'm going to add a tablespoon of baking powder and a teaspoon of salt. Now, I'm going to go ahead and knead my dough. So I have half cup of water here. I'm just going to add as I go along. I'm adding half more cup of water. So that's one cup of water. And you just knead your flour. You don't want it too soft and you don't want your flour too tight. So I'm still kneading. Go ahead and put your back into it. I'm just going to wet my hands with some water and just sprinkle it on. To get the texture that I that I want. There you have it. So here I have a baking sheet that I dust with some cornmeal. Now I'm just going to go ahead and make my dumplings. So I place, I'm going to place them on my baking sheet and allow them to sit for five minutes. Then I go ahead and fry them. So this is the amount of flour I'm using. And let me tell you something, fried dumpling that is one you can't go wrong with fried dumplings and you can go ahead and pair it with anything you can pair it with whatever meat can you have you can pair it with tuna sardine mackerel ackee and saltfish whatever it is so here are my dumplings I'm just going to allow them to sit and then I'm going to go ahead and fry them. So here I have um, my sauce pot 
I'm going to go ahead and pour some oil in it and allow that to hot. And the reason why I use a sauce pot is because it's deep and that's perfect for frying your dumplings. So after your oil has been hot, you're going to go ahead and place your dumpling in. Be careful when you're putting them in the oil so you don't burn your fingers. And you're going to turn your flame down and allow these to fry on a low heat so they're not burned and fry on the outside and not cook through the inside. So you're going to go ahead and turn your dumplings and you're going to fry them until they are golden brown. There they are, coming along nicely. There you have it guys, fried dumpling. Thank you for stopping by. Please have yourself a wonderful and blessed afternoon. Bye.